this bud has three set aside seed potatoes growing in it. It has one of each Saxon, Rooster and King Edward. Saxon is a large white potato, Rooster is a red skin and King Edward is a white potato with pink markings. When I empty this bag out, I would hope to find a selection of each that we can count and weigh. So what we've got here is a competition in a bag. So if you want to place a bet, if you want to have some fun, Saxon is the white potato, Rooster is the red potato, and King Edward is the white potato with pink markings. I feel it only fair to warn you that I've dropped a few of these bags before and King Edward has been uh, a disappointment, a big disappointment. So let's remove these tops, drop this bag, see what we've got. And as you can see, these tops are finished. I don't know whether I got blight or whether it was wind damage or a bit of both. But um, there's no growing left in that bag, so I may as well be out. Okay. I think Molly's going to have to move, don't you? Excuse me Molly, uh, there's nothing there for you at the minute, just let's see what we've got here, let's read this out. There's the seed potato. Let's just rip these guys out. Well, there looks to be quite a few Saxon. I've noticed a couple of King Edwards, only a couple, but not many roasts there. Oh, 
gone was and they were chomping away there. There's no more light. Oh. Yeah, that. There's one just rolled off the uh, when I'm sorting them out there, and one is just chased it down the garden and walked it. Just even to see the wallet itself. That one won't make the way in. Oi, oi! Get out of that! Well, potatoes left the way you're carrying on. Pile these potatoes up and try and sort them out. They are uh, Saxon. Okay, that's the Saxon part. Make sure there's no food marks on them, otherwise, it's a few of And rooster, well, rooster seems to flow. <laughs> Sorry, if you're back a rooster, you're back a non-starter. A long runner, whatever you want to call it. Second and Rooster, non starter. I'll go and get the skills. Okay, let's do these uh, King Edwards first, shall we? We'll count them in, just the bigger ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12. I'm going to pop these ticket ones on as well, eh? But we won't count them. But we will wear them because we will eat them. Maybe not over there. What have we got? Oh, two and a quarter pound of King Edwards. Okay. Two and a quarter pound of King Edwards. And I've counted them for you so you know how many there are.
Now this may be a bit of a balancing act because there's a few more of these uh, Saxon. But we'll try our best. If we can't, we'll have to bag them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, I'm just hold them on, fourteen, fifteen, Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. I don't want to count these titchy ones. Nineteen Saxons. So I think Saxons one on the count, obviously. There's one and the other one. Hold on. Does that many have fallen off? You can't. Pictures, but they'll all eat, so we'll put them on. And what have we got? That looks like just under five pounds. I will call that four and three quarter pound. Four and three quarter pound of Saxon. It's just a pity all three potatoes hadn't performed, but they didn't, only two did. Um, add the two together, that's what we've got in the bag. So, we've got two and a quarter pound from these King Edwards, we've got four and three quarter pound from the Saxon, that's seven pound of potatoes from that bag. Look solid clean potatoes, good potatoes. It's a shame the third one didn't grow, uh, otherwise we would have probably had quite a bit more than this, but it didn't. So from two potatoes, King Edward and Saxon, combined weight of seven pounds. Now my able assistant Molly has been uh, been with me this morning. She's been a good help. She's behaved herself, and this is the bit she's been waiting for. Yeah, Mum. I like to keep a few small ones for Molly. Here, this way, that here. Yeah. This one, darling, here. Here you go, darling. Couple more, only small. You like them, don't you? Good girl. Good girl. 